them work. Two women went with a small infant, walked inside the king's court, and one woman started, My Lord, we both live in one house. I gave birth to this little one. After three days, she gave birth to another little one. But she gave birth to a one who is dead. When I was sleeping, she has replaced my baby with the dead one. And she fights with me saying that this is my baby. My Lord, give us justice. Just imagine how the king might have felt and what things he might have thought about when he looked at this three, two women with a small infant of four days, five days baby fighting for that one baby. My dear students, parents, teachers and all the well-wishers, welcome back to another video. Wisdom is power to put our time and our knowledge in proper use. Wisdom is power to put our time and knowledge in a proper use. Many of us go wrong with wisdom and knowledge. Knowledge is know about something. You have the knowledge of computers, you have the knowledge of instruments, you have the knowledge of space. This is called knowing about things. Wisdom is the power to use this knowledge. The power to use the time we have in a proper use. Here in the king's court, king is in a dilemma. Whose baby it might be? Baby. New to gender. It is used. An English word. Here, both mothers, one mother is pleading, another mother is arrogant and saying, no, this is my baby. She has taken my baby. And here, wisdom, the wise king told his courtiers, bring that baby, put in front of my throne on the staircase, on the steps. And immediately one of the soldier, his left hand or the right hand strong soldier has brought placed on the steps and shown the baby to king king looked at the baby and looked at soldier and he said take your sword make this baby into two halves give one half to one woman and another half to another woman the whole court was shocked Everyone are looking at king. Is he mad? What kind of judgment he is giving? And the soldier also panicked. Should I do this? But it's a king order. And I am here to oblige and obey the order of the king. He has taken the sword. And he is about to raise his hand and make the baby into two halves. Immediately. The mother of the baby ran and fell on the baby and pleaded, King, stop, stop, don't kill my baby. Let her only have my baby. I can't see my baby being killed in front of my eyes. At least I'll be happy that someone is raising my son. Another woman with her rage She's screaming and shouting, let it be in two halves. That is the judgment of the king. It has to be, let the baby be in two halves. Then the whole court looked at the king with awesomeness. What a wise king. King walked and nicely held the baby in his hands. And he said, she's the real mother. The real mothers never wants the children to be killed in front of their eyes. That is the wisdom. A power to put our time and also knowledge in a proper use. He didn't take much time to give this judgment. 
that's why he's the wise king solomon the wisest of the whole earth his judgment is uh, it is a judgment of the times immemorial wonderful judgment of king solomon i want all of us to think about this wisdom it is not that we have the knowledge of something if you have the knowledge how you put that knowledge into proper use we have discovered and invented many things our invention is atomic power and nuclear power but when this atomic power and nuclear power in the hands of fanatics they made them into bombs and they destroyed the nations is this knowledge useful for us there is no wisdom there is no wisdom the one who thought of this atomic power was he was shocked and he was so guilty of his invention that this wonder the wonderful invention went into the hands of fanatics and they misused the power to kill the mankind and they destroy the earth that's why knowledge to put in proper use the given time time is important our next moment once this time is passed no one can give back the time to us the time to put in proper use is the power of wisdom let us all be wise in our choices let us all be wise the way we use the time the way we use our knowledge is it beneficial to our fellow beings or is it destructive think about this wonderful quote and the motivational quote and proverb wisdom is the power to put our time and knowledge in a proper use take care be blessed